hi sweetheart thank you so so much for stopping by the channel today if this is your first time here hi i always say to subscribe to share to like so just go ahead and use all the buttons provided down there and well if you're returning hi hello you are welcome back again to the family so today guys without wasting much of your time i'm just here to restart my pixie you've seen me do this before but this time right just a different hairstyle so guys let's get straight into this so guys here i am starting this with the neat hair let's not forget here that neat hair actually helps in growth of the hair so you always want to make sure that your hair is neat your scalp is right there where you want it to be so next right here what i'm doing is just to you know to protect my hair from heat since we will be applying a lot of heat to the hair so i just applied the um, heat protectant from trust me and now i'm just styling my hair in the direction where i want it to be and next right here guys is our styling foam and i'm just going to go ahead to apply this generously to my hair why i'm doing this is because if this is you know applied in the right quantity it actually makes the whole styling process easier instead of you know trying to struggle hand there it just helps the hair to flow in a certain direction which i think is nice so yes even though i feel this was applied in excess it still works for me because you you can see how i'm moving with that so guys right now i'm just going to brush this hair comb this hair make sure it's smooth and then i give it a wave so long story short guys i've really been struggling with you know this short hair and you know giving myself waves and stuff like that sometimes when i do it i just feel like i'm not really doing the right thing but then with time i think i've grown i've grown and maybe that's why we're here today to just show you guys the growth i've been struggling with waves and also with curls it's not one of those you know easy things i've been having with this hairstyle but then as you can see today i think i just gave that hair you know a certain wave and with those waves one thing i've learned is that you just have to be unique about it you have to follow your own hairline you have to also follow what it's best suited or what is the best fitting for you there's not a copy and paste kind of thing there are no rules to this thing there are no laws to it you just have to create yours and you'll be happy with it so here i am what i'm doing is just to enhance those waves i don't think i even needed this for this hairstyle but then i did it and yeah i'm so kind of happy that i think i'm conquering the difficulties i'm having with this hairstyle at the end of the day so guys now i'm just giving it the final touches and i went in with a wrap just you know to set down the hair and yeah i also learned a new technique this week right here on youtube like youtube has been a big saver guys a big saver so yes yeah, so just place your foam right there and just helps you hold that when you put that it doesn't move guys it doesn't move so i went in with another one and i think also with another one just just make it strong enough so i this also what i do i also usually would use the stocking cup this actually helps the up area and yeah <laughs> I had to eat so yes guys i went to a saloon nearby and here i am i'm back i've dried this hair and let's see what we have here so usually guys when i do those waves and i'm back i usually have it scatter you've seen it before in my videos but then guys i was so scared that it's going to scatter but then here i am it's still in place guys i was so happy because to me this is progress like i want to see myself i want to beat my own self in the game you get what i'm saying so yes guys I think I just did and I'm happy and I even pray that the next time is going to be better. So please go ahead and subscribe so we can go through this process together. I really want to be a badass when it comes to short hair. So yes, guys, please subscribe so you head on this journey with me. So guys, I realized that I had, you know, some excess and since it's a new month, I decided to, you know, just freshen up those cuts. So I just went in with a clipper, just nothing serious because I wasn't seeing my back and I wasn't using the mirror. So... And I also went in with my sideboards, bonds. <laughs> I don't know why to pronounce this is really a problem. So yes, I also went in to just you know cut off those areas which I think were not properly layered. And my brother came in guys with his own plenty drama and he thought I wasn't doing a good job to the back of the hair, so he helped me out. So thank you so so much to Wayne on Banks. And here I am, guys, trying to coil up this hair. Hmm. 
Quelling this hair, like I've said before, has been a struggle for me. It's really been a struggle for me. Despite the fact that I think the problem I have is that I don't have the right um, coiling tool right here. The size, this size is an inch and a half, and I think my hair is too long for it. So I need to get another one. The one I have is um, is bond. It's, it just got spoiled. So yes, I had to manage this. But I think for the side, it's actually the right. Um, the right size for it but for the middle is a little longer and i don't want to cut the middle because i want to do a little drama 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 with the front hair so no i'm not going to cut it so please manage with me right here so after i was done i just went in with um with um with a setting spray is that what they call that yes just something to hold that hair together guys so i am and this particular hair cream i'm just here guys to just moisturize this hair with oil you want to always make sure your scalp is not dry guys because if it's dry that means your hair doesn't have moisture you might even end up with dandruff you might end up with lack of growth you know a lot of things guys so you want to make sure your hair is moisturized properly moisturized and are we even talking about my makeup here guys all right no we're not so yes let's just go on. and now i'm just using a a tail comb to just you know pick up those curls i really wanted those curls to pop in so i just picked them up and at the end of the day and the size of that i just you know rose it up a little and here to even uplift it a little i'm going to go ahead to walk into my edges and also that side with um with the edge control so yes just that to make this hair even outstanding you don't want to forget your edges guys you always want to fix those edges because sometimes no matter how beautiful the hair is as far as those edges are not laid as far as the edges are not in place it just it just doesn't work so i'm not even that edges edges kind of girl i'm just you know i just give it some sweeps so right here guys i'm just here trying to hold that lifted area again I'm just here to lift up that lifted area. After I was finished applying the hold, I just went in also with uh, with, um, with with some heat to just put it in place, guys. And yes, you can see it's lifting, it's holding, it won't move. Like I'm not spending about two hours, three hours to make this hair, and then it's going to spoil the next day. Hell no, guys! I ain't doing that. So that's why I'm applying a lot of hold to that hair so that even when um. Um, this hair is covered and I wake up in the morning. I still want to style it I still want it to look like this, you know at least to transition to even a better style because sometimes you get that so yes And now I'm just putting in some edge control at the back of that hair to make sure it's sitting pretty You know and here I'm just giving in some swoops 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 whatever <laughs> And yeah, guys, here is the final look guys. I hope you love this look I hope you love this look and i hope you are going to subscribe to this channel share so you know we have this you know progress together i really love this look i love the way i looked i think it gave me a little you know auntie you know auntie mommy sister kind of vibe because i think our aunties in 60s and our mommies in 60s actually would, would should wear it or would choose this so yes guys i think i love this and yeah let me know what you think about this in the comment section and i will see you guys in my next tutorial don't forget to remain blessed don't forget to remain beautiful and from me to you is peace